Hey guys, how does engine oil work? The oil is stored in a sump or reservoir. The oil pump pulls the oil through a pickup tube with the screen to filter out large contaminants. The oil will then be pulled into the oil pump and placed under a great amount of pressure, which will then proceed to flow into the oil filter to filter out any small micron rating of contaminants. After that, it'll work its way into the oil passages, such as the bearings that support the crankshaft and give it the lubrication that it needs. Not to mention, it will help to dissipate heat for the pistons. It will also help with the carbon deposits. As you know of, the NOAC volatility rating will help in this area as well. Guys, the valve train, the upper part of the engine, well, this is the hardest part of the engine under the greatest amount of load where the engine oil really does its work. Guys, protecting against great amounts of wear and to help dissipate that heat. Using the right engine oil can definitely go a long ways. But I'll definitely say one thing. Yes, you don't have to use the most expensive engine oil out there. And if you're going to actually do it, you want the most protection. If there's one thing you can do, it's actually change your engine oil when your manufacturer suggests. If you want to change it earlier, hey, that's up to you. It's definitely not going to hurt anything. So just make sure you follow the manufacturer's recommendations. Remember, a lot of these modern engines, there's a lot of things that you don't realize, such as the performance of the engine is definitely going hand in hand with the oil pressure. Because if you go to a thicker viscosity oil, well, the variable valve timing is controlled by the oil pressure and it's going to change that, not to mention the drag effect that it'll have when you use a thicker viscosity oil. If there's anything you can give to help out others, please drop down in the comments and do so. Guys, I want to thank you for watching Nate's Interactive Auto.